Hello and welcome. In this video we're looking at the new Footy's favourite Maxwell Cornet objective. Um, as you can see he's a 93 rated left back card. He's got the Footy's card design, the very vibrant pink colour on his card. So the card has four different sections each giving their little reward and the first one consistent scorer giving the summer swap token two card as well which is brand new today as well. So First one up, consistent scorer. Score in four separate squad battles matches on professional difficulty. So, it, is it professional difficulty or higher? And obviously, it doesn't matter whether you win, lose or draw the game as long as you score a goal in that game, which is fairly straightforward. You get a gold pack, you get 50 XP and you get the summer swap token for this and you get to tick off the one quarter of the objectives required to get the card. Second up is through perf perfection, which obviously, yeah, obviously going to be a through ball related task. You have to assist five goals using through balls in squad battles or rivals on minimum professional difficulty. Uh, so as it says, you can do this all. You can do this in one game. You don't need to spread out over games. You can spread out over games, but you could do it all in one game if you were able to assist five through ball goals. Um, on professional difficulty or higher and it doesn't say whether you do it with defenders, midfielders, attackers or Premiership, Serie A, Bundesliga, icons, anything like that. It's just through balls and goals basically. You get a 75 plus rare rated player for that objective. The third one up is goals galore. You have to score five goals using Premier League players in squad battles on at least professional difficulty or rivals. So once again it's a really easy objective to do. Five goals you'll be able to do in one half against a low-level professional difficulty team, I'm pretty sure for most people. So that's a premium goal pack. Very easy to do that one. The last one up, winning mentality. You have to assist using Premier League players in seven separate squad battles wins on world-class difficulty or higher or in rivals. So as you can see, as these have all been on professional difficulty, they've jacked this one up to world-class difficulty, tempting you to do the whole thing on world-class difficulty, making it that little bit harder. But you can do this in rivals as well, which means you can get towards your um, rewards target, the weekly rewards target on that as well. And to do this, you get an election players pack for completing it. So that's the card overall. It's a decent card, a 93 rated left back. As you can see, not too many low um, level rating scores there. Volleys and penalties being the lowest, although to be fair, he scored a number of goals for Burnley this season. So his volleying should potentially be higher. Um, I'm not sure how we... I'm actually going to actually go take a look about how he ranks against the Cancelo card, like the Team of the Year Cancelo. So we'll go to... Concept, special, left, back, premiership. So we've got Cancelo here. That's his team of the season. And I mean, they're all... His dribbling is really good. The 95s as well. Pace is really high. Again, volleys and penalties are a little low. Passing is really good. Vision is good. Defending is obviously really good. And so is his physicals. And then we've got the Corne here. They are comparable. I mean, his dribbling is different. Is is more top heavy as in balance and agility rather than bottom heavy. The ball control, the dribbling, and composure. The passing is pretty similar. The shooting is comparable, and the pace is pretty comparable as well. But the Cancelo is a higher card, and to be honest, I would probably continue using that one myself. But, I mean, the Corne is a free card and you can just use it as you see fit, whether you're putting in him into an objective or whether you're putting him into um, just playing the game with him as you go along. Other than that, that's the, that's the card for today. It's a 93-rated pre Premiership card. Uh, he's not going to link too well given the country. I think, I think that's, an, is that, that's an ivory card. Oops. My bad here. I think it's Ivory Coast, isn't it? Yes, it is. Okay, so you won't get too many links with his nationality, but the league will definitely help. Actually, unless you use icons for linking nationality. But there we go. 
Um, so yeah, that's the card. It's a free card, just done through playing squad battles or rivals. So yeah, you can go through that and achieve that card. Any problems or any queries with the things if they're not registering at all, they should do. Or if it's something isn't going the way you should do with this card, just let me know below and I'll help out in any way that I can, as I do with all the other, the other videos. Thanks for watching. We'll end that. Cheers. Bye-bye.